Hi, it's uh, Bruce from uh, Cape Town, uh, South Africa, on an absolutely glorious day. If we can just break away for a moment and just have a look at Table Mountain in the background. That is the iconic mountain that visitors or seafarers see for the first time when they're heading into the bay. Uh, yeah, here we have a, a Compass uh, 47 that can only be described as in immaculate condition. She uh, was only launched around about six years ago and has been meticulously maintained and even upgraded in that period of time. Up front we've got a Prada and a heavy duty ground tackle. We've got a quick windlass. A very nice feature is uh, the dual head sails on, on furlers, one being a Genoa and the other one being a jib. As you can see the paintwork is absolutely beautiful. Same goes for the decks. Lots and lots of hatches which we've opened up for you to have a good look at. Um, as a heavy displacement blue water cruiser you would be very hard pressed to better what we are looking at here. You've got uh, dual solar panels, uh, common uh, radar up top. A fully integrated Garmin system with two chart plotters, autopilot, bow thruster, windlass, okay we've stepped on board and we're going to just make our way around. Notice nice flat flush decks, lovely tow rail down there, you're not going to slip over there that easily. Heavy duty uh, cleats, and as I was saying about the ground tackle, it's a no nonsense setup here. Also got uh, the soil for the chain to untangle itself. Here are the electric uh, pedals. Moving down the port side, notice the size of these hatches. Hatch leads into the uh, uh, four cabin or V berth, if you'd like to call it that. We've got a spinnaker pole, she's got an asymmetric, We've also got uh, mass steps on, on board, tensioning system, there's your boom vang. She's uh, SAMHSA category A rated. There's the life raft just come back from a service. Uh, the CRF is getting renewed uh, in, on Monday, this coming Monday, which is early, early September. The winches, the two primary winches, uh, are electric. All lines lead aft. Just move back a little towards the stern. We're going to get a lovely view from the houses position. You know, underneath this lovely bimini and the boom, you notice stops a good way short of the bimini, so there's no chance of any entanglement issues. She does also come with running backstays, which aren't on at the moment as the owner is not flying big head sails. Winches are all uh, Lumar and, in my opinion, well specced for this type of boat and the type of blue water sailing she'll be doing. They're all two speed um, self tailing. She has uh, davits and, as mentioned earlier, double uh, solar panels that combined with uh, the brand new uh, lithium ion uh, battery system and appropriate charges uh, leaves very very little to be upgraded 
Just gonna do a nice little pan around. Here's your view down the port, port deck. The starboard gunnel. And uh, here's our view. Okay, well, uh, let's uh, head uh, below decks and uh, see what awaits us. <laughs> 